Excellent! Memory. It's a vital part of every PC build, but memory should know its place. A Vexir had the audacity to send over this Raiden series kit of DDR4 memory, and it's left me flustered, quite frankly, with its flashy plasma lighting and brazenly provocative design. As tempted as I may be to simply stare at these delectable dims for hours on end, entranced by their ethereal glow, I... No! No! I will resist, because I made this channel to bring you guys the truth. So here are four reasons why you definitely should not buy fancy memory like a Vexir's Raiden series. Reason number one is fancy packaging. Fancy packaging is useless. Despite the clean design and appealing minimalism of the Raiden retail box, the fact is that it could be delivered in a brown paper bag, as long as ESD shielding was present, of course, and the kit would work just the same. Now, some might argue that the presentation, such as this, hints at the quality of the product within. Others might find that the slow and meticulous undressing of their new RAM is just a tantalizingly sensual affair. I mean, it's just kind of exciting to have your fingers gently caress each subtle curve and crevice of each module. I'm, I'm definitely not impressed, though. That's the point. Okay, I might have taken a picture and posted it on my Instagram and said I was impressed when I first got the box, but that was temporary, and I'm not anymore. Reason number two is size. Size matters, or so I'm told. RAM height should be as short and chode-like as possible to allow for disgustingly huge air coolers for the real star of the show, the CPU. Anything more is just gratuitous, so looking at these Raiden modules with their enormous size, truly generous proportions, indulgently tall, you might say, erect sticks that just seem to stand there like, hey, what do you think of all this? It just kind of makes you wonder if it will even fit. That's never stopped me from trying, though. Where was I? Speed! Yes, of course. Ludicrous speed. Extra RAM speed is pointless. Sure, you might get a millisecond or two faster response time or a half a percentage point better score in your favorite system benchmark, but sensible PC builders know that the minimum speed, 2133 for DDR4, is perfectly adequate, and going beyond that is silly and not even really officially sanctioned by Intel. In this kit, DDR4 3000 with C16 timings, I mean, Sure, you could brag to your friends about your tight timings and how your memory works day and night like some kind of machine, just relentlessly pumping as much data as possible with every clock cycle, probably barely even breaking a sweat. So maybe your friends would be just a little jealous, but jealousy's bad, so case closed. And number four, of course, is that plasma lighting. I mean, seriously, ever since this RGB lighting craze exploded, it seems like every manufacturer wants to shove some LED festooned monstrosity down our throats. And sure, the Raidens may have plasma lighting, which is not LED and is fairly unique in the PC landscape. And though I may have been choked with nostalgia when I first powered them on, and maybe with the lightest touch of my finger, I was eight years old again, gazing in childlike wonder at a mysterious glowing plasma orb at the Discovery Science Center. So no, I, I felt no real connection or need to have this be part of my life. I mean, who wants to feel the simple and innocent joy of childhood warming a callous and icy heart long thought incapable of love? Certainly not me. So with my four points proven, I think the best thing will be for me to keep this DDR4 kit out of the hands of anyone who might be misled by its flashy allure. You know, it's already installed in the test bed. I could, could probably just leave it there. That's all for this video though, guys. I tried to have a little fun with it, so your feedback, as always, is much appreciated. Let me know if you enjoyed by hitting that like button or leaving me a comment. Links to this RAM kit, as well as my store where you can buy shirts, are down in the description too. Thanks for watching, as always, and we'll see you next time.